Hi, foodie friends. Today we are making lemon drop martinis. They are sweet, tart, have only five ingredients, which makes them easy to whip up for any occasion. Let me show you how to make one. We're gonna start with making a lemon sugar that is gonna be perfect for rimming your glass. We have a quarter cup of sugar and the zest of one lemon. The lemon zest is gonna cut through the sweetness of the sugar. Sugar is really gonna absorb all of that delicious lemon flavor and it's wonderful to take a little lick off the rim before you take a sip of your tart martini. Mix them together. You can also make this ahead of time if you're having a party. Put it in an airtight container. You can make it a few days ahead of time and it'll store fine at room temperature. In order to get it to stick to your glass, take a lemon wedge and run it around the rim of the glass. And then dip it in the sugar. So, I like a lot of sugar. I'm getting it in there real good. And voila. Set that aside while you make the actual martini. Start by filling your shaker with a good amount of ice. Having enough ice in there is going to chill your martini. No one wants a warm martini. The main component of this martini is vodka. We're going to do two ounces of vodka. It is a lemon drop martini, so we've got one and a half ounces of fresh lemon juice. Having fresh lemon juice is really going to make all of the difference, whether your martini really tastes amazing or just kind of meh. You want it to taste amazing. I'll tell you that right now. Three fourths ounces of simple syrup. Simple syrup can be bought like this one, or you can make it yourself. It's a mixture of water and sugar melted down and really concentrated. Helps balance out all of the acidity and also the citrus flavors. And lastly, three quarters ounces of Cointreau. This is an orange flavored liqueur. So we have lemon, and orange in our perfect lemon drop martini. Put the lid on the shaker. Oop. Make sure it's on really tight. And then shake, shake, shake. Make sure it's nice, chilled, and blended. Got our glass, it's already rimmed. I like a little bit more pizzazz, so I'm gonna put another piece of lemon on it and strain. Every little bit out, right? You worked for it, you did all that shaking. From my kitchen to yours, cheers. <laughs>